A brush fire that started in Arizona jumped the Colorado River and is now burning in California. The pirate fire has now burned at least 1,200 acres of trees and vegetation, mostly in Arizona. It's also being called the Topak Fire. Two RV parks south of Needles, California have been evacuated. Several fire departments are working in the area. Crews were first alerted about the fire around 4.30 this morning. The, ca the cause of the fire is unknown, but investigators are considering it suspicious. Arizona's wildfire season officially started just two days ago. Cronkite News reporter Kendall Bartley visited Flagstaff to see what impact El Nino's unusual climate will have on our state. Just a few years ago here in Flagstaff, a huge fire caused evacuations, damages and major flooding. So I spoke to officials about what to expect for this fire season. The 2010 Schultz fire in Flagstaff burned over 15,000 acres. Tina Adams, a Flagstaff resident forced to evacuate, was asleep when the mountains behind her became engulfed in flames. I went out to, to look at the mountains and I took a picture and, and it just looked like a, an angry face. That fire grew quickly because of high winds and forced the evacuation of more than 700 homes. This year, El Nino is causing unusual conditions this fire season. Typically, El Ninos are expected to bring water than normal conditions to the southwest, but that's not what happened this year. So what does that mean for fire season? We are in worse shape at this time this year than we were last year. So it's kind of setting the stage for what could be a significant fire season, but to see how it plays out, we have to wait until May or June. Last year, the state didn't have as many wildfires as in years past. There was high levels of precipitation in May and even rainfall in June. Gerilyn Byrne, a FireWise specialist, says the fire departments are already holding drills to get the departments ready, doing fuel treatments and thinning around the city. Clean up around their home every spring of any flammable debris or materials kind of close to their home. Officials say fire season is only going to last three months long and should be over by the end of June. In Flagstaff, I'm Kendall Bartley, Cronkite News.